All right, Ro, so with a touch-enabled computer in Windows 7, you can actually use this in the most intuitive way possible. So there's going to be a lot more of these computers around, and what happens is your finger actually becomes the mouse. So now you're no longer tied to just using your mouse and keyboard. You can actually open up documents or go to web pages just with the touch of a finger. So using Windows Touch makes the computer a lot more natural to navigate through, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to go into Media Center. If I go ahead and click on my music library here, I can select that. And then if I slide my finger across the screen, you'll see here it's very easy to navigate through my music library. So I watch and record a lot of uh, TV on my computer. We're going to navigate down to the TV section. I'm going to click on Recorded TV. I can click on the program that I want to watch, select it, and there you go. Grab your popcorn. Oh, I really like that. All right, so I use Windows Live Photo Gallery all the time to edit my photos. So let's go ahead and see how that works with touch. So we're going to go ahead, go into my Windows Live Photo Gallery. You'll see here I've got all my photos. I can use my finger to go ahead and browse through all of my photos. So let's select one. You'll notice with my finger how easy it is to just shuffle through all my photos. Then if I want, I can even do some quick fixes just by clicking up here on the top. You can add some cool effects if you'd like. Yeah, and it works on the web. If you're using Internet Explorer 8 and Windows 7, you can do things like navigate through pages, which is the flick of your finger. Wow, this is great. That's really good.